Last year, it was reported that Bianca Sensori and Kanye West had found their dream home, which was a penthouse in West Hollywood they're renting for 20 k per month. It seems to still be where the couple's living and it boasts a minimalistic design, a private theater, heated pool, and much more. However, that move came as Kanye's former LA mansion was left to rot only two years after purchasing. Photos showed crumbling walls and fallen fences, as well as abandoned items scattered across the multi-million dollar home, including an abandoned barbecue smoker and a 4x4 tank. Bianca Sensori and Kanye West's relationship has been a fixture of the public eye. Whether it's Bianca's wild, barely there outfits, or the fact that Kanye is the one who's probably dressing her. Bianca, an Australian architect and designer, first came into the spotlight through her work with Kanye's fashion line Yeezy, and they soon became a couple. Bianca Sensori and Kanye have been living in a $12,000 a month rental in West Hollywood after spending several months living out of suitcases in locations like Italy and Miami. Kanye has taken revealing photos of Bianca posing in their modest Los Angeles apartment. Although some units in this complex are priced around $20,000 a month, Kanye and Bianca are reportedly renting a smaller unit than previously thought. Their apartment, which spans 1,820 square feet, features one bedroom and one and a half baths. Now, despite its size, the apartment is described as an architect's dream online, with rent estimated at around $7,000 a month, though it was listed for nearly $12,000 in 2021. A source claimed they have been at this place since early last year before they started traveling, and sometimes they have the kids there. It's simple but luxurious and currently serves as their main residence in LA. Kanye's ex Kim K previously mentioned on an episode of The Kardashians that North prefers her dad's small apartment over their multi-million dollar mansion. Kim said North goes to her dad's and says dad is the best, he has it all figured out, he doesn't have a nanny, a chef, or security. He lives in an apartment. And then she'll cry, why don't you have an apartment? I can't believe we don't have an apartment. Bianca and Kanye were previously residing at the five-star Nobu Ryukan Hotel in Malibu, where rooms start at $2,000 per night with a two-night minimum stay requirement. Their current apartment, which the couple moved into last year, is conveniently close to Kanye's Yeezy headquarters on Melrose Avenue. The apartment features a minimalist design and offers a 24-hour concierge service, a private cinema, a heated pool, and a rooftop cafe. Kanye and Bianca's cozy apartment also includes a private den that can serve as a library and a spacious closet. While Kanye isn't using a personal chef, building staff are available to provide full menu and drink service. It seems the couple has been conducting their own photo shoots at this apartment too. This move came after Kanye listed his Malibu beach house for $53 million after a major renovation and many of his other properties have been left in disrepair. Apparently, Kanye's former Los Angeles mansion, which he bought for $2.2 million in 2018, has been left to deteriorate. The property, abandoned two years after purchase, now features crumbling walls and fallen fences. Pictures show rubbish and abandoned items scattered across the multi-million dollar home, including an abandoned barbecue smoker and 4x4 tank. More recently, in spring 2024, Kanye lowered the price of his minimalistic Malibu mansion that he's still trying to sell. Initially listed at $53 million, the Concrete Fortress has seen a significant price cut with Kanye reducing the asking price by $14 million, bringing it down to $39 million. The reduced price likely reflects the fact that the 4,000 square foot interior has been totally stripped bare, requiring the new owner to complete the space. The listing notes all interior finishes have been removed and the property will need work to either restore or reimagine the interiors. According to Jason Oppenheim of the Oppenheim Group, who is the listing agent and appears on Selling Sunset, he says it will take several million dollars to finish the house. And that's a lot of money. Well, Kanye purchased this designer, Tadeo Ando Design Property in 2021 for over $57.2 million, making it a challenging investment given its current state. The 2013 property is one of a few private homes in the US designed by the Pritzker Prize winning Japanese architect, whose minimalist style is just up Kanye's alley. 
The home is situated just steps from the Pacific Ocean on a nearly 6,000 square foot lot and is constructed with about 1,200 tons of concrete, 200 tons of steel reinforcement and 12 large pylons sunk more than 60 feet into the sand. Now the ultra modern home also features Ondo's signature smooth concrete and abundant natural light inside. From the street, the structure looks indestructible with a concrete facade and frosted glass. However, the beach facing side shows pivoting glass walls and a staircase leading to outdoor spaces and the ocean down below. The property was listed for $75 million in 2020. Then Kanye purchased it at a lower price and began a big renovation, which as you can see, remains incomplete. Now, even with the price adjustment, the home may be hard to sell. It's unique as can be, but also isn't even close to being finished. It doesn't even have fixtures or appliances. After looking at where Bianca Sensori lives with her man, Kanye, we can see that they're living likely more modestly than you thought. I mean, they have an expensive and lavish apartment, but compared to his former homes, it's humble. What do you think? That'll wrap up today's house tour. Thanks for watching. I'm Kara the Vampire Slayer. Follow me on Instagram to chat, and I'll see you in another video. Bye!